What's up? I'm Ryan Nyquist and uh, today we have a very special project. So rewinding a little bit, like late 90s, I used to do, well I still do, but like a lot of bar spins. And uh, people used to be like, you must have like a spring load headset, kind of making jokes about like, you know, just tons of bar spins going real fast. Um, so today I kind of want to see if we can make like a spring load headset, like something that will actually help spin the bars around. Uh, we have a few different theories, but we're going to try to just be here in the garage and test it out and see if we can make one work and uh, see if we can actually ride the bike and make it do a bar spin on its own. So the first idea we had was uh, basically really simple but using bungee cords. But it didn't really work because it didn't have that snap so the bars were kind of starting really slow and not spinning fast enough off the bat. So the second idea was uh, we had, well Shay built this rig with the spring and it had this thing coming off the stem that when you kind of like loaded the spring it was going to spin the handlebars around but the no, spring right. had too much tension, so it was really hard, and when you actually got it loaded, you couldn't steer, so it was, uh, and it didn't really even spin the bars anyways. Third idea we had, because the first two didn't work, is we kind of took it to that next level, and uh, we got some model rocket engines, hooked to the handlebars in opposing directions, and then uh, set the charge to them, and uh, they spun, they spun a lot, like, I think like 15 or 16 times around. But I, you know, like I, I, just, I did not feel comfortable being behind that, so I said, no way I'm doing that. So after three failed attempts, we had to regroup and just kind of figure out like how this is going to work or if it worked. And what we came up with was a remote control bar spin bike powered by a cordless grinder. So remote control bar spin bike, this is what we ended up doing. Took this little box of junk and took all the radio stuff out of it. And then we hooked it up to an angle grinder with a little electronics. We're going to place it up in here on the side with some ho hose clamps. Then we're going to wrap a cable around this front piece that I machined out, put it on the lathe in the mill, made it fit in there nice so it'll spin the bars. Then we're going to take this remote control and when you gun it, it should unspin the bars and spin the hot out of them and hopefully we'll get eight or nine bar spins out of it. I personally like the rocket one but Ryan's kind of a wussy so I guess we'll just go with this one. Testing, testing. I think it's good to go. Alright, ready? Yeah. Take my hands off and then hit the switch. Whoa. All right. Woo. Well, I like it. Woo. All right. Well, it works in the garage. I guess uh, tomorrow we'll find out if it actually works on a real jump. Yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna let you sleep on it. Uh, yeah. More like nightmares. All right. Here we are. Moment of truth. And uh, I, like to be totally honest. This seemed like such a good idea when we were just talking about it and now that I'm looking at the jump and uh, I don't know man. Well I brought some extra rockets just in case you get a little scared. Oh yeah, in case mechanism. this doesn't work. We can hook that one up and yeah. we can do that instead. No, that's a logical next step. So. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> so Alright, <laughs> let's work on this thing. Let's yeah. do it. I'm gonna take a little a couple practice runs. There we go. Ah yeah. I think it's gonna be good. He's got time. He's got the no handers down, so all I gotta do is press the button to see what happens. Can you press the button? Oh my god! It didn't move! It didn't move at all! It spins when it's sitting here, it just doesn't spin up in the air. Why though? I don't know. So this thing, I don't think this motor's cutting it, dude. It's in there, it's just, I don't know what's going on. Maybe the battery's a little low, which I don't think so, but, you know, we need to redesign this and do like a serious remote control rig. Overhaul. Overhaul. Oversized motor, oversized battery. Just full bore. All right, here we are again. Uh, what version is this? Version. 5? 5.0 5. 5. 5. I think. 4 or 5.0, maybe 4.5. Yeah. But um, this is it. This one uh, can't fail. I got back in town and last night uh, went to Shea's shop and checked it out and uh, it's crazy. <laughs> yeah, we uh, we definitely pipped this one out. I spent a little extra time and uh, upgraded the whole system and put a little pulley attachment here so we can 
You have a direct drive bar spin, and this thing is gonna rip. No janky cable, it's like belt drive. Yeah, this is legit. This one is What is this? Full speed Where does this come from? This is the motor off a of CB750, the starter motor. Motorcycle? Like, yeah, motorcycle. <laughs> got a motorcycle battery set up, got the whole remote, and I had to run a, a separate solenoid to power the pulleys and everything. It's a little bit heavy, but dude, it's like, this is like our bikes where they used to be, like in 95, like 40 pounds pushing. Jeez. Yeah. Thing's gonna move. You'll be used to it, right? Well, we got a good downhill, so I'll have a lot of momentum. <laughs> there we go, man. I think you're good to go. All right, let's do some testers real quick. All right. All right, this is just one first. Just one. Ready? Whoa. Ooh. One again. Ah. One. <laughs> Dude, it kind of hurts. This thing's got some power. That was freaking awesome. rad, dude. No way. That was the craziest feeling ever. Just like, <laughs> ooh, and then just like, click, wah. Oh my god. Nice control finger. Yeah, it was like a video game. Oh. <laughs> All right, this guy just got completely awesome. And I think it's gonna get a little bit more awesome. How you feeling about that? Um, that was, I'm, I think, I'm topped out of that awesomeness right there. I think we can squeeze double awesomeness out of here. I at this think point. I'm pretty topped out. I need more awesome to be able to pull in with awesome, Shay. Well, it's getting awesome, man. We gotta get awesome. All right. Woo! Sorry. Okay. Oh, oh. Nope. Oh. <laughs> right. Yeah, I was like moving out so hard. I was like, oh god, no brakes! Oh. Sorry, sorry. Woo! Oh. Dang, that was awesome! Holy oh. crap, dude. Oh, dude. Oh my goodness. That was that like was sick. Perfect. Perfect. Oh my oh. god. Alright. Dude, I'm done. Don't even ask for three. It's not happening. Done. Oh. Man, I'm pumped. <laughs> Wait, shake it off. That was like... Oh! Oh my god. Woo! Oh, another high five, dude. So sick. Oh! <laughs> There you have it. Two bar spins unassisted. Well, I guess I had an assistant, Shay, yeah. but you know, just let the hands go and trust that he can hit the switch enough times. And two bar spins, man, that's that's awesome. It's pretty amazing. Great success! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh.